Here's another problem where we'll simplify a complex fraction using the LCD method. First thing we want to do is figure out the LCD. So the LCD for all denominators here is x and x minus 5. And remember you take each factor that you see in a denominator the most number of times you see it appearing in any one denominator. So even though we see x minus 5 showing up twice, it's one factor and it shows up the most one time in any denominator, so only take it once. And same with the x. Next thing we're going to do is multiply the top and bottom of the complex fraction by the LCD. So we'll multiply top and the bottom, so times x times x minus 5 times x times x minus 5. And what that does, if we distribute, we get the LCD multiplying each separate term. So let's go ahead and do that out. On the top we start with x times x minus 5 and that's multiplying 1 over x minus 5 and then plus again the LCD x times x minus 5 and that's multiplying 5 over x on the bottom we get x times x minus 5 multiplying 8 over x minus x times x minus 5 multiplying 1 over x minus 5 and now we want to divide out common factors on the top left we have x minus 5 and x minus 5 Th those divide out to 1 and on the top right we have x and x bottom left x and x and bottom right we have x minus 5 x minus 5 so let's write what we have left over we have an x plus 5 times x minus 5 and it's really important to keep the parentheses around the x minus 5 so that the 5 is multiplying the entire x minus 5 and not just the first term of it. And that's all over 8 times parentheses x minus 5 minus x. And now we'll simplify what we have. Let's clear parentheses on the top x plus 5x minus 25 and same on the bottom 8x minus 40 minus x and combine like terms we get on the top 6x minus 25 on the bottom we have 8x minus x 7x minus 40 and then we would look to see can we factor and divide out common factors um, but we can't, so we're all done. There's the answer.